Well, hey folks, Fat Guy Flies RC. Sorry mama had to work, so you gotta put me in the GoPro. We're gonna take up the free wing Avanti version two, 80 millimeter. All right, let me get it down here. Let me do a uh, control service check real quick. Hey, right, left, up, down, right, left. All right, got the free wing afterburner in her. I'm gonna fly my mid rates today, which for me are 80 percent 30 percent expo all the way around all right here we go kind of a windy day but then again that's what i always get the avanti is one very incredible locked in airplane Yeah, I think mid rates are fine. Time remaining, three minutes. All right, start slowing our roll down. All right. Gear down. Landing flaps. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting I'm filming with a GoPro. So I'm supposed to try to stay closer. Breaking. I have found that with the Avanti, you don't want to hit your, you want to build your great uh, brakes more gradual because the braking is worked really well with those nozzles pointed down and you'll nose in really severely and i've had a few actually actually strike the nose despite the gear and because of that braking so brake more gradual with the version two here first one didn't have it anyways but you need to brake a little more gradual kind of ease into it so you, know, you got to plan your approach accordingly all right let's take off take off the gear I like these mid rates. Did not need takeoff flaps. Fly it like a jet, because it is a jet. It's not a trainer, it's not a high wing, it's a jet. Let's bring it down kind of low, closer to the runway, like I'm going to do a landing approach. But the gear is up, flaps are up. Make sure my gear and everything's down. Bring it by dirty. All right, we we're flying pretty hard. We're gonna make this landing here and that's gonna be it. I was flying a lot more full speed than normal because I just enjoyed myself so much. Braking. See what I'm saying? Be more gradual with your brakes. Brakes off. Flaps up. 
All right, let's see what kind of speed we had. And I'll show you my GPS and where I've got a very interesting place to put it. All right. Motor off. Motor off. All right, we had 38 seconds left on a four minute and 10 second timer. So basically we flew for what? Three and a half minutes? All right. I'm going to go ahead and stop the GPS and hit read. Stop. Read. Oh, wow. We went 630 feet was our highest, and we were flying 124 miles an hour. Not bad at all. All right. 124, 630 feet. All right. Now, let me show you where I have the GPS right there underneath the canopy and it just it, this is the gm gnss performance analyzer by sky rc and um i got it um from rc juice but the app's turned off so when the app goes off when you turn the app off you turn the uh the gps turns off that way it saves your battery now let's check our battery and see how much life we have left in the tank Battery is pretty warm, not super warm, but warm. 33%, so I don't go up again. Well, folks, that is the Freewing Avanti version 2. Great, stable, locked-in plane. And off you caught the receiver, I've got a Lemon RX Gen 2 7-channel receiver that is not gyroed. It's just plain Jane receiver. Nothing really fancy about it. Just a good lock-in signal, and it does have the ability to set a fail-safe, which I think I set the fail-safe for uh, maybe two millimeters up on the AR elevator, and that was, and everything else was neutral. To kind of give it a, a somewhat of a chance to climb. <laughs> well, folks, thank you so much for watching. This is Fat Guy Flies RC, and that was our uh, speed analysis of the Freewing Avanti 2. Y'all have a good one. Don't forget to like and subscribe. God bless y'all. Bye-bye.